Good day. Today we're going to discuss oral communication, enhancing verbal skills. As Christopher Morley says, there is only one rule for being a good talker, learn to listen. The significance? Strong oral communication skills enables meaningful interactions, resolving conflicts, and fostering connections. For relevance, the ability to convey ideas effectively is pivotal in personal, academic, and professional fields. The roadmap of the presentation has here, first we do the definition, importance, benefits, then the tips for effective oral communication, and last is conclusion. Now we go to definition. It says here oral communication refers to the process of exchanging ideas and emotions through spoken words. It includes discussions, conferences, interviews, telephone call, or direct conversation. It is vital in building rapport and trust, and builds relationship, improves teamwork, and increases opportunities. For the importance, first, effective expression. Provides platform where individuals convey their messages with precision and impact. Second, building relationship where individuals can establish connections, build trust, and foster empathy, leading to stronger personal and professional bands. The third, for collaboration and teamwork, it enables team members to share information, coordinate tasks, exchange feedback, and work together towards common goals and efficiency. For conflict resolution, it allows individuals to express concerns, understand different perspectives, and find mutually agreeable solutions. And the last, for career advancement, employers value individuals who can articulate ideas persuasively, deliver engaging presentations, and communicate effectively with colleagues, clients, and stakeholders. Now for the benefits. First, clarity and understanding. It ensures the intended message is accurately conveyed and comprehended by the receiver. Second, influence and persuasion. Proficient individuals can influence and effectively persuade others. Third, enhance social skills. Individuals can actively participate in discussions, share experiences, and empathize with others. The fourth one, increase confidence. When individuals can express clearly and articulate ideas with ease, it boasts their self-confidence. And the last, for career advancement opportunities, individuals with excellent oral communication skills stand out as effective communicators and become highly sought by employers across industries. For the next part, we have the tips for effective oral communication. The first one, is to prepare and organize. Allow us to set clear goals, identify potential obstacles, and devise strategies to overcome it. The second one is active listening, rephrasing, ask questions. This part involves fully engaging with speaker, giving undivided attention, and understanding message beyond words. An individual can demonstrate genuine interest and comprehension by maintaining the eye contact, nodding, rephrasing what the speaker is saying, and asking clarifying questions. And the third one, there must be a practice, clear articulation that prevent misunderstandings, confusion, and misinterpretations, and can foster active listening. The fourth one is the rule of nonverbal communication. Utilizing the nonverbal communication by understanding the gesture and body language. And the last, there must be seek feedback. Provides valuable insights, perspectives, and suggestions to identify areas of improvement. And for the conclusion of the presentation is that the ability to convey ideas effectively is vital in personal, academic, and professional fields. I have here a diagram showing that the importance of oral communication plus valuing oral communication benefits plus utilizing the tips for oral communication this three here can create a meaningful interaction resolve conflict and foster connections and that's all for today thank you